Seven Durham schools closed today. Teachers and staff once again protested uh, the second time actually in less than a week. CBS 17's Dina Harley has the list of demands from teachers and staff. Oh. There's folks who are reporting that they were expecting to getting like $350 and some folks are getting $10 checks. A weeks long pay dispute leading to more protests in Durham Public Schools on Monday morning, forcing seven schools to close as teachers and staff call out. It comes after a school board meeting last week ended with no resolution and some staff members saying they're still missing out on hundreds of dollars. At the beginning of the school year, they took my 20 years of experience into consideration and then January I did get an email saying that they was bringing me down to step zero which cuts my pay over $600. The Durham Association of Educators released a list of demands ahead of another meeting scheduled for Thursday including no pay cuts for February paychecks, a public explanation of January pay cuts and a scheduled work session for meet and confer with the association. If we get to the Thursday meeting and the demands are not met escalations will continue the next week. Some staff saying if they aren't paid what they were promised they'll be forced to leave Durham altogether. If I'm going to get paid at a lower as zero, I might as well get paid where step zero is more money, which would be at that point, you know, a different county. Staff tell me at the end of the day, they really want transparency from the district and a seat at the table moving forward. In Durham, Dina Harley, CBS 17 News.